Technology is now allowing parents to not only monitor their teens' cell phones, but also their cars. And I can tell you a few apps out there that are very good at this. Yeah, at I do. speaking I from a parent it. of a teenager yeah, exactly. over here. yeah. Who's driving? Yeah, I got it. <laughs> Chevrolet is rolling out new technology for its newer model cars that allows parents to set a teen driver mode. Mm -hmm. Enzo Marino reports on the settings that mom and dad can see behind the wheel. According to the National Safety Council, more than half of all teenage drivers will be involved in a car crash before they graduate high school. For parents, watching their teen back out of the driveway for the first time can be a little unnerving. A uh, little bit of intrepidation right there. There is a little bit of hesitance, that's for sure. After all, most parents remember what it's like to get their license. I was a child too. OK, and uh, mom and dad didn't know everything I did. But new teenage drivers may not have the same luxury thanks to Chevy's teen driver technology. So all the newer models, um, actually 12 out of all the models that we have come with the teen driver standard. Never mind street signs, parents can now decide a speed limit for their teen. If I listen to his friends, he's the greatest, safest driver in the world. But. Uh, I'm sure there's those occasions that get every young man. Another feature on this model Chevy is the teen driver report card. Parents can set a secure pin number, come back in here and check how their teen has been driving anytime they want. How many times they use the uh, traction control, how many times they don't wear their seatbelt. My one son, he seems to have every friend in the world on the same page where, oh, he's never taken that RPM over 3000 RPMs and you know, Never did we go fast, and he won't go more than two miles an hour over the speed limit. Now, mom and dad can verify that. Teen driver will let me know that, that's for sure. Sorry, teens. Welcome to driving in 2019.